something that's really uh, something that's manufactured. So will the government lead people to believe there's been some kind of alien invasion that aliens are here? Is it possible that kind of thing is done to deceive people, to scare people, to get people to, to go where they would otherwise never go? Could Satan use his demonic realm, his demonic beings, fallen angels, demons, to, to appear as extraterrestrial or more intelligent life from another planet? We know that many of the folks in the UFO research arena have come out. I've, I've shared their videos of them saying it. Some of them were experts believing in extraterrestrials now say openly, uh, no, these are not entities from another realm. We don't see them coming in on the radar. We don't see them going out on the radar. They appear and they disappear instantly. This is demonology, demons. But yet there's this drastic increase all of a sudden in the last few years in, in, in UFOs. And the Pentagon working with a Harvard professor and Harvard scientist on, on UFOs and even the Pentagon with this report I've read from uh, last year talking about uh, a mothership not far off that sends probes to Earth to evaluate what we're doing. This you Did you ever think you'd see the day the Pentagon would put out a report with a Harvard so-called scientist and, and <laughs> say, oh yeah, there's a mothership. And they're sending out like little dandelion seeds to probe the Earth. What is, what is the stage being set for? A global deception. Will some of it be the government and technology and holograms and other things to deceive people, to scare people? Will it be those who are on earth who are involved in this spiritual demonic deception who are working in concert with Satan, whether they know it or not, by using technology to deceive people on earth while Satan uses his actual demonic demons to manifest themselves, to reinforce the narrative? Are you listening to what I'm saying? Humans on earth who are following a demonic plan, a demonic ideology, some of them may be fully demonized themselves, using technology to deceive people, to make them think they're seeing things that are manufactured with holograms and technology, artificial intelligence, they're doing that on a physical realm on earth with technology while Satan himself uses his fallen angels, demons, to manifest themselves in a literal way that furthers the narrative. You know, it's interesting. Ronald Reagan gave a speech before the United Nations, and I've played that here before. He said, I often, I'm paraphrasing, I often think about how we would respond as nation states, should we all face a common threat like an alien force? I always thought that was kind of a little bit of an odd speech. Certainly not the kind of speech I would give if I had been president, but then again, my wife wasn't involved and isn't involved in a horoscope and all the other crazy things Nancy was involved in. But I always thought that was kind of an odd speech. But then again, maybe he knew about some things going on and things being developed in the intelligence world. Maybe he knew of certain things that were going on that were being developed to deceive people. I mean, he, he was calling also for something called Star Wars, as it became called, for fighting wars in space. And now we see that's exactly what's happening with Iran and North Korea and China. But that's an interesting speech going back to Ronald Reagan at the United Nations. The, the framework, the foundation seems to have been laid a long time ago for getting people to think and talk about these things and be ready for this massive deception.